It is really easy to look at today's reading of 1 Timothy 4.12 and focus only on the first part, but we'd be missing so much if we didn't look at the second half of the verse as well. Let's look at it again. No, really, look at it again. I'm going to put it up on the screen. The second half calls us to set an example for others in the words we say, in the way that we live, how we show our love, and, and then even the way that we live out our faith. Listen, I'm going to put on my dad voice for a second, so just bear with me. We have the responsibility as Christians to use whatever influence we have to set a good example for the people around us. So stop and think for a second. No, really, take a quick moment, pause this video if you have to, and think this through. Think about the kind of example that you want to set for others. Do you want to be patient? Do you want to be a faithful friend? Do you want to be incredibly kind and generous? This week, here is a challenge for you to take. Take one step, just one, to set the example for others. And honestly, here's the thing. It should be pretty easy because we can't really go anywhere right now. So practice by setting an example for those closest to you, which would probably be your family or those that you live with. But don't let this stop. Uh, don't let this stop you from either uh, reaching out to your friends or maybe someone at the store as you walk by or whoever. Jump back in tomorrow as we continue on this 15-day devotional called Popular.